If you guys watch TikToks, you guys run into different kind of ads each time. And they could be like comedy, they could promote a song, they could promote, you know, a specific kind of channel, a school, whatever the fuck. But yet you run into like those few ads that j you just pick out, you're just like, this is a one of a kind kind of ad. Not the best, I would say, but effective. Uh, so in front of me, I have a collection of some ads that I saved onto my camera roll. They have just been absolutely amazing, unique, and, you know, one-of-a-kind ways to create an ad. So we're just going to go ahead and have a look. Clearly, I like Subway. People who are on diets like Subways. People who love expressing their odd love to the American youth love Subway. So, next video. This is Mr. Wogglebug. He wants to become a friend to you and your children. He's very lovable and wise, and I made a whole movie starring him called Sylvie and the Wogglebug which you can get on DVD at the link below. He laughs and cries and jokes and brags and helps his friends throughout the film. So get a DVD while they are still available. Okay, okay. well, that, that's that's the fucking... Uh, but as you can see from the read of the comments, it created quite a discussion. Everyone was like... <laughs> Wogglebug is back? <laughs> So I remember along with this ad, uh, I came with a website where you could buy the actual movie made by said person. But So we're just going to look it up right now and see if it, it's still fucking up, man. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Dude, five fucking stars, man. Five stars. Okay, so Sylvia and the Wogglebug is a wonderful movie for kids of all ages. It has great characters, good values, and a rich world. It has charming animation that is sure to delight kids and adults alike. The voice acting fits each other well, and I cannot wait to watch that in a separate video, so um, that's going to be really cool. Um... They came out with uh, four movies. Would you look at that? So you got The Incredible Tale of Mr. Wogglebug. You get a Wogglebug plushie. It's on pre-order, so guys, uh, get those get those orders in. Um, so Sylvia and the Wogglebug. That's the move. so yeah. Let's. So, okay, return policy. I do not accept returns and only refund canceled orders. Okay, shipping is free. Alright. Um, so they basically give you the entire fucking plot. I'm not going to read it. Uh, but if you want me to watch this uh, horrific movie, then, you know, drop a like down below and I'll be sure to buy it. Uh, raving reviews... A lot of five-star reviews. Probably fucking greatest movie of all time. And a majority of the population doesn't know. So, I'm going to fucking buy this one day. We're going to watch the whole thing on edibles. And I'm going to record it, give my honest opinion. And I'm going to move on to the next fucking haunted ad. Does anyone feel like life sucks sometimes? I wrote this how not to be sad anthem. So drink up, get wasted, we only got one shot, let's Clearly, 
you know, blessing us, uh, regular hardworking people, uh, to a privileged song about how life sucks, sung by someone who makes probably millions of dollars, but yet killer lyrics, you know, um, gives you that whole summer vibe, even though we're in August, pretty much summer's over. Uh, yeah. Yes, Lee K, I do. Life sucks a majority of the time. I want to get a Coke Icy when I go to the movies. They only have cherry and blue raspberry. I just... Mmm! <laughs> Life sucks, man. Life sucks. But she wrote how to not be sad. So we're going to examine the lyrics, you know, in the video. We're going to see how we can't be sad. Because Leah K wrote this song for us, you know, us, that, you know, we're included in her posse. Life sucks. And this song is supposed to bring us together. Okay. Anyone feel like life sucks? Sometimes? I wrote this how not to be sad at. So drink. Okay, so drink. You're promoting alcoholism. You know, it's one of the leading causes of death in, you know, our country. But yeah, uh, totally drink. You no, know, get your mind, get fucking drunk, get wasted. Hey, go full milk shit. Eh? Okay, um, I mean, I don't know if you mean by like one shot, like, hey, we only have like one shot of liquor, so let's like, let's take it, get drunk. I'm pretty sure you can't really get drunk off of one shot, but all right. So get wasted, we only got one shot, let's waste it. Okay. They'll never remember what your name, who's Zay? Who's Zay? So, you're telling me to like, whore myself out to just like a random person? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they can say the same about you and your music. Stay up, get tattoos, and make out with the stranger. So, you're gonna... So, I'm gonna be sleep deprived. I'm gonna get a permanent ink. You know, majority of your listeners are young young children so I'm pretty sure they're they're not really old enough to get a tattoo yet and make out with the shirt yeah um I'm good I'm not looking to get herpes anytime soon so you know I'm good in the ba in the bathroom okay so yeah I'm definitely not gonna get the herpes or an STD anytime soon so I I'm good Lee Kate um, Yeah, I, I agree. You know, life totally sucks, but wasn't this supposed to be like a sad anthem? I don't know, like, if you're really promoting this song as like an anthem for life sucking, even though you're clearly uh, winning at life, making, you know, millions of dollars, and here you are saying like, Hey man, your life sucks? Listen to my shitty song, it's gonna get you bumping in the greatest fucking movie ever. So drink up, get wasted, we only got one shot, let's the next time you apply for a job, the next time you're about to go and meet girls, do that. You will feel different. The next time you're going to go to bed, if anybody sleeps poorly or you'd like to improve your sleep, do it before you go to bed. It's got you from sleeplessness to sleep in day out. It also increases testosterone. It's really healthy for your body. Harvard has done studies on this. Power posing is what is called two minutes. So what's happening in his brain right now is the cortisol levels are being reduced. You don't have to believe in it. It just works. But by up to 20%, cortisol, fear hormone, is actually being reduced. Still feel like fucking auction, man. He's a dating coach for confidence, dating advice for men. I already have someone in my life, so you know, maybe I should do this more around them. And then next time, guys, if you ever see a girl ever coming up to someone, or you just like, you have a drink, you don't know what to say, you have social anxiety just like me, just go out to a girl, be like, hey, trust me, it works about. <laughs> 
0.5% of the time, but it works, man. It works. Now, I think uh, for this last one, I might need to have to bring out the premier product of all time. It's what? It's sweeping the nation. It's Fushigi! That's right, motherfuckers. The Fushigi is back, dude. Back and better than ever. I'm actually practicing on becoming the new Fushigi master. Like, I can already do this. I can do that. It is a hard bot. Like, honestly, dude, this is not the ideal toy you want a kid holding. So thank God I got at the ripe old age of 24. Appreciate my girlfriend for getting me this, so thanks. So let's get on with the last ad. Like I said, we need this. We decided to try Alpha Grade. Before Alpha Grade, I felt unproductive by the time I started my evening job. I knew I needed a better way to promote focus and sustain my motivation. Okay, so Alpha Brain it is loved by Joe Rogan, athletes and entrepreneurs. Uh, let's kind of break down this kind of ad because I'm, I'm lost. Maybe I need fucking alpha brain, man, because I'm just so lost. So I worked three jobs and decided to try alpha brain. It's hard out there, dude. It's fucking hard out there, man. And you know, man, if you're working out three jobs, um, all my respect goes towards you, man. Like, you're fucking grinding that shit. Life is hard right now. I felt unproductive by the time I started my evening job. So I get it. I sympathize with you there. So you said, I knew I needed a better way to promote focus and sustain my motivation. Ever heard of a dab pen? I, I think, I don't know, maybe on the job you might just go back in. No, no? Okay. That is the whole ad. There's no scientific research that goes into what is inside these only 1100 likes, so clearly, you know, it's it's selling numbers, man. It, you know, it's going out there. I mean, I'm not going to go ahead and really kind of like uh, go after this because I, 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 you know, I'm no fucking scientist. I don't know what is in this alpha brain kind of shit. I kind of want to look at behind the scenes. I've just been reading the captions. Her looking at her phone. And you got her wiping a table. Then you have her dropping and then dropped it, but you just kind of look like... Dude, 